Hello all, how are you? Today I have come with a very funny and interesting story which has been taken from Aesop's fable. So the title of the story is The Frog and the Ox. Once upon a time, a young frog was sitting with his father by the side of the pool. Just like us, huh? we, all, we all are spending time with our parents. So the frog was also sitting with the father. The pool was shady and cool. And the frogs were sitting happily among some rocks. They watched for passing flies, minding their own business and chatting to pass the time. Oh, father, said the little frog, I have seen such a terrible monster. It was as big as mountain, with horns on his head and a long tail. Hush, child, hush, said the father frog. That was only farmer's white ox. It isn't so big either. It may be a little bit taller than I, but I could easily make myself quite as bored, just you see. And now next we will see what happens. With that, the frog blew himself out and blew himself out. And blew himself out. How you blew? <laughs> yes. What? 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 You're so poor, so, so, so huge. Was he as big as that, he asked. The young frog looked and thought for a second. Oh, much bigger than that, father. Again, the father frog blew himself out. And blew himself out. And blew himself out. Then again he asked his son. If the ox was big as that. The little frog looked and thought for a minute. Bigger father, bigger. He replied shaking his head, giving a nod. Huh? So the father frog took a deep breath this time. Hmm? He was all set. And blew himself out. And blew himself out. And blew himself out. And he swelled and he swelled and he swelled and he swelled. And then he said, I'm sure the ox is not as big as poo. But at that very minute, all the breed whooshed out of him. And he flew up away. You know how the balloon, the gas comes out and balloon just flows away? Zipping around like a balloon. Wow, said the little frog. The ox was big, but he couldn't do that, father. Ha <laughs> ha, this is a very, very silly story. Huh? There's also a lesson in that, which is pride comes before a fall. So now let's see what Kavya has to show us today. That's great, Kavya. Working out indoors will surely help keep ourselves and mind healthy and fit. Very good. See you all. Ta-da!